Well, hello, welcome everybody. Delighted that you've been able to join us for our ongoing coverage of the preliminary stages of this competition. We have an intriguing top of the table clash for you, where the focus for both teams involves no longer qualification, but which potential opponents and of which calibre they will be meeting in the opening round of what could be considered the business end of the competition. Making sure you hold on to top spot, we all know what a difference that can make. Blue and burgundy wherever you look, hymns ringing loud and proud. This is what it is to be in the Camp Nou. Jim, how are you reading the formation? Yes, and the importance of this formation is not to allow the midfield three and the attacking three to become too detached from one another. If that happens, then pressure can quickly be applied via the counter-attack and you can be exposed defensively. So compactness can't be compromised. And you need talkers in this team. You need leaders and people that are willing to organise things very quickly. we go then who do you think this turns on Jim yeah I think we can expect to see more than a few moments of individual brilliance with Neymar on the pitch Peter he's got such a silky touch he can ghost past defenders shapes to shoot it's off target and by quite a way okay it's come to nothing but it's a warning of further threat on the break into some space that's great strength on the ball chance oh, good effort he got plenty on that yeah the shot was enabled Peter due to such smart control and technique Battles to win it back. Oh, good interception. Clears it out of harm's way. Well, they could break here. Messi tries lifting it over. He's found his man. And he's cut it out. He gets past it, has a pop! Mbappe. Forward it goes. He's through. Yeah, he was under pressure to get that exactly right, and he couldn't even think of the consequences. It was instinctive and rock solid. Mbappe. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many possibilities. Mbappe. Some excellent tackling here, and that one a perfect example. 
Paris Saint-Germain have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. It's a decent ball. Just the has a goal. It's any and the follow-up. Roma reacted well to the initial effort, but couldn't get it right out of the danger area. That's just top-notch, showing exactly why he follows it up every time. Keeper struggles to hold on to it, ball breaks kindly, he's always about. Barcelona take the lead, 1-0. Well, just listen to the reaction, I think you can hear the approval from the support all around the stadium. Going through, and it's Bernat. Adama Traore, nicely measured pass. And that's the end of that, it all started well enough. Tries to get it forward quickly. Dembele, a oh, real chance, going for goal! Barcelona are really pouncing on any straight passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. Barcelona take a two-goal lead, and things should be comfortable from here on in. Well, they're very much the better team at the moment, Peter, and, and no doubt we'll be looking to, to cause even more damage here. Wijnaldum. Over to the left. Neymar is on to it and can take it up. Roberto. Memphis Depay. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Roberto drives it forward. Hits one! Oh, nearly, but nearly is nothing. Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. Adama Traore. He's made sure that that won't get through. Bernat hoists it forward. And they win it back again. Barcelona are ahead here. It has been a good half for them. And it's played forward. Well positioned to make that interception. That's offside. Yes, it is. Donnarumma sends that a long way. Feinaldum. Neymar, it's a loose ball, Roberto, and we've reached half-time. 
the first half compared with your expectation? Barcelona just didn't want the half-time whistle to be blown. Convincing and controlled. Barcelona ahead 2-0, and they are looking good. And we're off again. Marco Verratti. Neymar. What a throw in. Marco Verratti. It is a corner. Messi goes short. Out for a throw. And it's Ferrati. Marquinhos. And that has put pay to that. Yeah, he's fouled him there. Just a talking to, I think. Yes, it is. position was good and that helped the keeper to judge the flight of the ball and, and deal with it well. Jordi Alba. And back to base. Dono Roma gets it upfield. Roberto. Here's to Pai. And now the breakaway. He spotted the run and played him through. He's got away. Can't get the better of his opposite number. That's great defensive work. It doesn't take too much imagination to guess what would have happened otherwise. It's admirable, but ultimately he didn't know when to look for support. Memphis to Pai with a long pass. Oh, well defended, that had to be done. A real chance to break. Bernat. And it's Ferrati. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Memphis Depay. Well weighted. He's left his man. Cut out in the nick of time. You can get that clear. Now it's Dembele. Memphis to Pai. Lingered over it, and the chance to counter had gone. Oh, Peter, the best counter attacks are, are pacey and incisive, we know that. And that one never really got going. The referee has brought play back and showed him a yellow card. There is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's good. Up he gets! That's a half decent try. A more than decent attempt, Peter. Very much in that, not far away from being a telling final ball. Ah, quality deserted them when they really needed it. That's good defending, very good defending. Oh, 
That's Dembele. And it's Memphis to... Memphis to play! No attempts. That's the wrong outcome. That's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried there. Kozawa, Marco Verratti, gets it back, tries to get it forward quickly, gets away from his opponents, Dembele, shot at goal, a real chance and a real let off. Barcelona are looking quite mean on the counter and combating that requires even more meanness. Hakimi cuts it out. Well, the moans and groans from the stands now are very audible. Memphis Depay and his flag offside. Paris Saint-Germain are making a change now. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag, and he was never going to last until the final whistle. has got good distance on that. And it's Roberto. Keeper sends it forward. Marquinhos does well there, alert. Keira. Ahead by two and just about into the home straight. Wijnaldum goes looking. Memphis Depay. Adama Traore. No complaints about that challenge. Robust but fair. Goes for goal! Yes! And they are cruising away. Oh, that always looked like the outcome. And all engineered, Peter, by some smart running and movement. That's already something to admire, but how about the pass? Just wonderful. Loved it. The changes then in quick succession. A warm ovation on his way off, and that is the least he deserves. I think he's put in a good shift, and, and their fans appreciate that. I think he could feel pretty happy with the, the contribution he's made. Three without reply. 
This is becoming a stroll. Keira. Feinaldum. Marquinhos. Kuzawa. Marco Verratti. Into a minimum of four minutes additional time. And Icardi! And that's off target. Oh, that is asking, has a hit! It goes to show he is human after all. the tie Ferran Torres it's a brilliant interception Hakimi and there goes the final whistle Barcelona class apart opponents torn apart they are comprehensive winners what are your thoughts on today's game then Jim Barcelona have declared themselves